giving the increase in power of private interests and corporations, sometimes overriding the United Nations and nation states. My question is, what can be done with new actions by the United Nations for respect for rule of law and abiding by treaties? Specifically, I'm interested in SDG 4 on education because we're seeing greater incurrence of private interests in public education. Thank you. I'm Jill Christensen from the National Education Association of the United States, a proud member of Education International.